Hello guys, my name is Dennis Kaderi. Welcome to my YouTube channel. On this video, I am going to show you how to use voice mode. Voice mode is a voice changer application that you can use to add different voice effects to your voice. You can make yourself sound entirely different using voice mode. So to download voice mode, you are going to head over to the official website voicemod.net. I have the link in the description of this video. When you're on the site, you are going to see something like this. When I scroll down a bit, you can see that you can use voice mode on Discord, Meet, Google Meet. You can even use voice mode when you are playing games on your PC. Down here, when I hit on this download voice mode for free, I can download voice mode completely for free. Voice mode also have a pro version that you have to pay for. But the difference between the free version and the pro version is that with the free version, you get a limited number of voice effects that you can use for the day. That is for every 24 hours, voice mode will give you a minimum of five voice effects that you can use for the day. So once the 24 hours elapses, you get a new set of five voice effects or more that you can use for the day. So that is how it's going to continue until you purchase a pro version and you get unlimited access to all the voice effects that are available in voice mode. So to kick off your download, hit on this download voice mode for free and your download is going to kick off. And then you can see that you can download voice mode for Windows 10 and 11. So after downloading and installing voice mode, when you open it, you are going to see something like this. So right here, as you can see, I am using the free version of voice mode. And these are the voices that I have available for me to use for the day. When I scroll down a bit, down here, I see all the other voice effects that I have or that are available in voice mode. But they are locked. I cannot use them because I have not upgraded to the pro version. So right here it says unlock your identity and right here you have different plans. You have quarterly plan where you have to pay $3.99 per month and annually plans $1.99 per month and lifetime license. It is a one-time payment where you have to pay $29 and you get an unlimited access to voice mode and its voice effects. So I'm going to close out of this. So that's it. But for now, I'm okay with the free version. So before you get started with voice mode, you need to do a few configurations. So you are going to head over to the settings. So right here within the settings, you can choose or you can select an input and an output device. So right here, I'm going to select an input device on microphone. So I have my microphone selected already and I'm going to scroll. When you scroll down, you get the output device. Or speaker so you are going to select whatever speakers you want to use if you have multiple speakers installed in your PC so I have my system speaker selected and that's all so I'm done right here I'm going to head over to voice box where I have all my effects so after selecting your inputs and your outputs device right now I have my voice effect set to clean which means that no voice effect is being applied down here you have this voice changer button now when you toggle this on so right now the voice changer is on and active, but it's still set to clean, which means that no voice effect is being applied to my voice at the moment. Next to the voice changer button, you have the hear myself button. When you toggle this on, you'll, you'll be able, able to, to hear, hear yourself as you speak through your uh, output device, that is your system, or whatever speakers you chose as your output device. I'm not, I'm not going, going to be needing this, this so I'm going to toggle it off. You know what? I'm going to turn this on so that you can hear me. So, so when, when I select any of the effects, voice, voice enhancer, enhancer. You see, see that, that it makes a little bit of change to my voice. voice. Now, now when I select, select custom, custom speech. speech. Now, now this, this is what custom, custom speech sounds like. I have. I have I have, I have magic, magic chords. chords. I, I can, can also, also add magic chords, chords to my voice. Next, Next I have evil. This is what evil sounds, sounds like. like. Alien. I can, I can also, also make myself, myself sound, sound like an alien. I can, I can make, make myself, myself sound like I'm underwater. underwater. Hey, I can, I can also, also make, make myself, myself sound like a stranger. stranger. And I'm lastly, lastly for the voice of the day, I have Frankie. So that is it. So those are the voices I have available to me for the day. 
And some of these voice effects have um, different properties on the right hand side of the screen. As you can see, the clean voice. On the clean voice, I have the clean voice selected and I can set the bars. I can set the middle tone, treble, mix, and uh, volume. So many of the voice, so many of the voice effects have properties that you can play with their values to get exactly what you want. So whichever voice effect you choose or whichever voice effect you select that you want to use on your voice, make sure that you check if the voice effect has properties on the left hand, I mean, I mean on the right hand side that you can tweak. So if you find this video helpful so far, please do where to subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications. So voice mod is one of the best, if not the best voice changer you have out there that you can use for your voice manipulation. Like I already mentioned, or like you saw on the site, you can use voice mod on Zoom, Discord. So let me quickly show you a quick example. So I'm going to give you a quick example in Audacity. So here I am in Audacity. To use voice mod with Audacity, you are going to head over to the inputs device. Within the inputs device, you have voice mod virtual microphone. So immediately you install voice mod on your PC, it is going to install a virtual microphone in your system. So you are going to select the voice mod virtual microphone. After selecting the microphone, you are going to head over to voice mod again. This time you are going to make sure the voice changer is on. Select a voice effect and then you can go ahead and start recording on Audacity. So I'm going to select Magic Chord. Now this is me using Magic Chord in Audacity and you can see that the voice effect flows through to Audacity. Now when I play this back, now this is me using Magic Chord in Audacity and you can see that the voice effect flows through to Audacity. So that is it, that's how to use voice mode on other softwares. So it is basically just choosing the voice mode virtual microphone as the impulse device in the software you want to use voice mode with. Whether it's Zoom, Discord, Audacity like I just showed you or OBS or when you are playing a game and you are good to go. So if that is it for this video, if you find this video helpful, do well to give the video a like, subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications so that you get notified when I post a new video.